Sometimes you need to let a mad person know that wherever your madness stops is when mine begins. So Laura feels bad. Let's put H on the matter. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, Afro Juju, eh, Afro Juju, eh, the difference is close. To be the Afro Juju. Oh my love, eh, eh, eh. The legendary, legendary Sheena Peters is in this episode. <laughs> Young, so fabulous, please, sir. What is the secret to your ever young, ever gorgeous? Ah, uh, please let me not spill the tea. Hello, guys, welcome to another episode of Rehas Wife of Lagos. Mm, the review episode nine. <laughs> and as you know, your girl is going to give it to you heart, heart, heart. This episode started where we saw Miriam, Tiana, and Chioma. They went to an art gallery where they have to draw and they have to chit chat. They have to talk about what has passed and what has not passed. And they just want to get to know each other. Guess what? Chioma was the first person that appeared there. She came early. Actually, Chioma deserves an award, Abby. Chioma. And this award for repentant soul of the year goes to you. And they discussed. And at that place, we just saw that Choma is all about looking out for herself. And at this point, Tiana told herself the truth that everybody's looking out for themselves. Let her to face reality and look at herself. And Tiana is trying to, to remind Choma that Choma like coming to show so that she will show herself, she will show her clothes, that Choma should calm down, that she, Tiana, she is the queen of all queens. She is the fashion goddess, that she runs 33 businesses. Oh, shame, oh, shame, baddest. Oh, shit, but they see those are the kind of women I want to be. I don't know about you. You know what it means for a woman to be running 33 businesses and she's doing it successfully. Man, you are truly the king of fashion. Yes, the queen, king, whatever of fashion you call yourself. We appreciate you and we love you. And after that, people. Eh, eh, we saw the legendary Sashino Peters. <laughs> In case you don't know, Shina Peter, they brought Afro Juju to Nigeria. They are like one of the four famous people that this song, Afro Juju, have been in existence for more than many years. And Shina Peters, oh my god, it was such a relief seeing him bringing back my childhood memory. Apparently, Shina Peters is Tony Lawani's stepdad, like <laughs> she's famous. And Tony's mother's father, that is her, her grandfather, was an ex minister in Nigeria. So we can see where the word is coming from, Abi. But mind your business. Anyway, sir, our husband apparently wants to be a musician or is a musician because I know her husband is a photographer. But she, she wants her husband to go into music and her husband have to do his first song with the legendary Shashino Peters. And they were in the studio cooking us some beats. So very soon, <laughs> TikTok will be on fire because when Tiana will release that song. And then there's one thing I want to tell people that I've seen. I, I know that people would that share good wealth is cashing out of Tiana. See, if I marry somebody that is famous or have money, please, I have to make my own name. And that's what Shagu Wealth is trying to do. Shagu Wealth is Tiana's inspired husband. And he's trying to go into music. And what better way to do it? Like, then with Sashino Peters. I love that. I appreciate that. And the next episode, we saw um, Caroline and Chioma. Caroline is into construction. And they were discussing. I know now when they discuss, they will still discuss other people. And they brought in Laura. I don't know. Laura and Chioma, I think they have some underlining issue they don't want us they don't want to talk about so they brought that they brought the choma the ages what happened apparently and caroline was trying to say that see where another person madness stop now dear my own madness is that and she apparently she came that last episode prepared for laura and she even have to show choma her bangles that have like that she intend to use to injure somebody and i was like that is all shade wrong we are all women there are things apparently we should not do it's it's wrong what do you want to do oh my god didn't you see my bangle <laughs> they... Caroline, that bangle was a weapon i came to defend myself i know somebody can get to your nerves and what whatever happened to walk away just walking away does not make you a coward but once in your life just walk away walk away ah at this point i'll just say we move we move so you can imagine why I'm wearing this traditional attire. Hey! hey, hey. So Yabos Ojo's daughter's birthday, Priscilla, she's 
21 years old and Yabo Ojo is 42 years old, Abi. She gave birth to her at the age of 20, 19, going to 20, and she celebrated her 21 years old birthday. I like, <laughs> some of us want that birthday too for ourselves. We never got to 21 years birthday, and <laughs> but we'll do it for our children, God's willing. And all the stars were there, or all the cast of the Rehouse Wife were there. Laura came, and Laura had to leave on time. Her excuse is she wants to go and take care, she wants to go and be with her husband and her kids. She can't afford going home late, which we appreciate. But I think they are putting Minnie into it. Like, Laura just wants to leave on time and all that. She says she's going to meet her. Her husband and her kids i don't think there's anything wrong with that she have kids that are below five years old yeah yeah hey, today is all about me hosting the cultural day this is tiana cultural day hey, hey. see see i love everything in africa <laughs> i love see africa gives me joy there's this joy being africa there's this joy wearing your Akara, wearing your hey, African print. And you become that glamorous, super shows. Oh my God. <laughs> A 10 over 10. I love all their outfit for the African day, which was supposed to be Tiana's mini party. It was her 45th birthday, her 40th birthday. And initially she said she didn't want to celebrate, but she just wanted to do a little get together. And Choma was ordering for uh amala i want amala like amala and assaulted <laughs> anyway sha i love everything in the world i love that one of my fav was there they really they really was there and guess who performed at that event nice congaso 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 Hey, Congaso, if you don't rock, if you don't rock this song in your university days, <laughs> go and download it and rock it now because her hey, nice is ever young, ever ah, ah mm, that song is ever green. Like, okay, so nice was the performing artist for the day. See, Tiana. Give it to Tiana when it comes to events, when it comes to show. She she do it hundred percent, and the, all all the ladies accepted that Tiana won when it comes to organizing and everything. And at this event, she now announced that they are going to ooh, Dubai, eh, Dubai, and they flew to Dubai. I we are in, see, we are, as I'm talking to you guys, we are in Dubai. <laughs> I'm in Dubai, <laughs> and I'm supporting Miriam in this episode. Why would they give Miriam a baby's room? No, it's very wrong. See, it's all shade of wrong. Why would they give a baby's bed and a baby's room and a baby's cubicle to Miriam? It's wrong. Is it because she's like, but like me, like, it's not nice. So apparently they went to Dubai and they had to arrange like a castle for them. And everybody was supposed to rush and get a, a room. And the room left was a baby's room. And that was the room that was given to Miriam. And Miriam was not happy about it. And we, the social media fans, we are not happy about it. Like, oh my go God. By respect, let's put age on the matter. Because I know your family has for me to get a kid's room. It's all shade drunk. And Miriam have to call Tiana aside and tell her, see. Miriam is saying that if it's by age, her age is more than three people in this place. She wonder why they'll give her a baby's room. She's not taking it. She's not accepting it. Miriam, we are not taking it. We are not accepting it. Either you change the room or we start all over again. But why will you give Miriam a baby's room? Is it because she's like, but see, this justice for Lekpa people. Justice for Lekpa people. But justice for us. Just is is it's unfair. Is is unfair. Anyway, Sha. At Dubai, everybody were having fun. As, as you know, initially, Laura, after the fight, she has been distant. She has been keeping to herself. And everybody are all catching fun. They are having fun. And Laura was not in the fun. And at the dinner, Laura decided to open up and tell them, yes, she knows she has messed up. But now she, that they should come back to friend that she was here. Child. She's here because of Tiana and all these things. Child. She wants to change a green leaf. And you trust Chioma, always ready with the glass boots, you understand? I get what you're doing and I appreciate it. And because I know what you're doing, I don't respond to you. They are now in Dubai and that is where it's ended. Next one, we'll be expecting some glass from Chioma, from Laura, 
and others so in everything this episode was fun because i love the african part i love the part where they're putting on the african attire and everything i love the african part so guys there's, if there's anything i'm missing put it in the comment section below i've made it a point that i will not be making this video to be very long again please apart from the real housewife of lagos please do watch my other youtube videos because i go all the way out in abuja to go to places to show you places you never know existed so my name is pat hey have a do it to subscribe like comment and click on the notification bell so whenever i drop a new video mm, 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 you'll be the first to be notified stay fortified stay partified stay glorified stay magnified stay peaceful all right i'm an adult it's becoming very childish i don't want to be part of this so.